Is warmth the same as happy? A lot of people say smile more and we tend to buck that because a lot of people do fake smiles and they don't look very natural or happy. We tend to look at appreciating. Appreciating brings warmth. But today I had to face a difference between the warmth of appreciating and just being happy. My client was facing a presentation and they had their content down and they had generally good presence but they were coming across cold, so we started appreciating. And I was surprised, appreciation brought some warmth, but it still wasn't positive enough. And I was thinking, you know, I just want this person to seem happier. I knew that they had a dog, and I said, hey, I want you to tell me about your dog. And I want you to just tell me why you love your dog. I want you to just love your dog. And this person talks about her dog and lit up. It was the perfect term for it was delight. She was delighting in her wonderful dog. So I can't believe I said this. This sounds absolutely hilarious. But I said, okay, tell me about your clients. And I want you to love them like you love your dog. She did it. And her vibe was so great. It was super warm and very positive. In a sense, she was appreciating, which was my goal, but the happy side came out and she was much more fun. Her personality loosened up. We took that over to the presentation itself and said, hey, here's your presentation. Here's your content. Let's love that like you love your dog. And her personality blossomed. We came upon the term for her. It was delight. We need you to delight in your material. And that delighting got to a more positive space. So I realized there is a difference. And there are times when just being happy serves the presence function even better than the warmth of appreciation. We still want our command balanced by our appreciating, our warmth. But the other way to do it is our command balanced by joy. So that was very, very useful. Then we went into the presentation and she started doing it with so much more joy, but it would sort of fade out and she would end up flat again. So it wasn't lasting. I asked her if she's ever hosted a dinner party and like most of us, she said, yeah, yeah, of course I have. And I said, how do you need to feel in that dinner party that you're hosting? She said, happy. I said, yeah. And are you able to do that? Yeah. How long do you have to be happy? And she says, well, you have to be happy as long as the party goes. So that might be an hour, two hours or three hours. So you just basically have the job of being happy for a period of time and you can do it. She said, yes. So I went to the moment before the doorbell rings, before her friends come over, and I asked her, how does she feel then? And she's like, well, honestly, probably frazzled because I'm, yeah, the dinner's not quite done. Things aren't quite the way I wanted to. I need another 15, 20 minutes, really. And then the doorbell rings. You open up the door, and you find that happy, and you stay in it until they leave. In this particular presentation, my client had a trigger that made her afraid and made her flatten out. And that trigger was recording in progress. Recording in progress. Oh, I'm being recorded. And suddenly it throws her. What we did is we associated that recording in progress cue with the doorbell ringing. Just before your guests arrive, you're totally frazzled. You're trying to figure things out. Doorbell rings. Hey, it's so good to see you. Come on in. Come on, sit down. Boom, I'm in my joyful mode. I have my happy, I'm delighting in my interactions. So I started having her practice her presentation by hitting the record button on my Zoom window and suddenly recording in progress. And she started to think that's the doorbell. And she opened up the door into her presentation and brought a lot of positive energy, a really great vibe, and was able to keep it because you aren't just happy when they walk in the door. Conversation may shift this, but generally speaking, you're happy for the entire dinner engagement and you're going to be positive, the business version of happy for the entire presentation.